Hello my dear friends, I am Sujoy and I welcome you to my first video on financial mathematics using Casio FX 901 ES scientific calculator. Today I will tell you how to calculate simple interest or SI and compound interest CI on FX 901 ES calculator. Also I will tell you some formulas related to compound interest. So let's start. Our first question, calculate simple interest or SI of Rs. 1000 for 5 years at 9% per annum interest rate. So our solution, we know the simple interest formula is SI equals to P into R into T divided by 100 where P is the principal amount, R is the rate of interest per annum and T is the time for which the money is invested which is P in, into R into T divided by 100. In our case, 1000 divided by 100 is 10. So 10 into 9, 90 into 5 is 450 rupees. Next, next compound interest. The general formula for compound interest is given by A equals to P into 1 plus R to the power T, where A is the amount after the time period, R is the rate of interest per annum or calculated yearly, and T is the time duration of investment. Here are some modified version of the same formula for using in special cases. So A equals to P into 1 plus R by 2 to the power 2T when the interest is calculated half yearly. And A equals to P into 1 plus R by 4 to the power 4RT when the interest is calculated quarterly. And A equals to P into 1 plus R divided by 12 to the power 12 T when the interest is calculated monthly. So A equals to P into 1 plus R divided by 365 to the power 365 T when the interest is calculated daily. Basically the number denotes the interest is calculated times per year. In this case interest is calculated 4 times per year. So it will be 4. So let's take a question. In what time would the sum of money travel itself that is triple itself at 10 percent compound interest. So our solution let's take our principal be 100 rupees. So P equals to 100 rupees R equals to 10 percent per annum or 10 divided by 100 or 0 0.10 and T the time we have to find out and A is 300 as it will treble itself or triple. So putting into the general formula it becomes 300 equals to 100 times 1 plus 0 0.10 to the power t which is equals to 300 plus 1 plus 0 0.10 is 1.10 to the power t. To remove this to the power we have to take log of both the sides. So log 300 equals to log 100 plus t times log 1.10. Log 300 is 2.47712, log 100 is 2 plus t into 0 0.04139. Press the log button, log 300 and press equals to is 2.47712. Log 100 is 2 and log 1.10 is 0 0.04139 0 0.04139 so 2.47712 equals to 2 plus t into 0 0.04139 or t into 0 0.04139 equals to 2.47712 by transferring this to to this side minus 2 so t into point 0 0.04139 equals to point 0.47712 or t equals to this divided by this equals to 11.52 years approx. So the money will travel itself in 11.52 years. And now I will tell you how to do it directly on this calculator. For that we will program it. So 300 press alpha and this calc button for equals to 100 
times 1 plus 0 0.10 press this button for to the power and our t will use x so press alpha and write parenthesis for x so it's now formed and now press shift and the calc button and solve for x so enter your guess for the t so let's uh, say our guess is 10 years so press 10 and press equals to it will calculate the value for you directly so x is 11.52 years isn't it cool let's take another question in what time will a sum of money double itself at 10 percent per annum compound interest payable half yearly this question is almost same just we'll use the half yearly formula so let's take our principal is to be 100 rupees so p is 100 a is 200 2 times of 100 or double and r is 10 percent or 10 divided by 100 or 0.10 and t we have to find it out so putting into the formula 200 equals to 100 into 1 plus 0 0.10 divided by 2 times 2t this is the formula for half yearly calculation which is equals to 200 equals to 100 into 1 plus 0 0.10 by 2 is 0 0.05 to the power 2t or 200 equals to 100 into 1.05 to the power 2t to remove this to the power again we have to take log on both sides so log 200 equals to log 100 plus 2t into log of 1.05 so log of 200 is 2.301 and log of 100 is 2 plus 2t into log of 1.05 is 0 0.02118 so 2t into this equals to 2.301 minus 2 so 2t into this equals to 0 0.301 so 2t equals to 0 0.301 divided by this number which is equals to 14.2115 so t equals to 14.2115 divided by 2 equals to 7.10 years so the money will double itself in 7.10 years and now I will tell you how to do it directly onto the calculator for that again we will program it 200 equals to for equals to press alpha and the calc button 100 into 1 plus for fraction press this button 0 0.10 divided by 2 right parenthesis to the power 2 and for x press alpha and the right parenthesis and press shift and calc so enter our closest guest say again it's 10 years and press equals to so our required answer is 7.10 years so friends this was my tutorial on simple and compound interest using your fx 901 ES calculator how was the video let me know in the comments below if the video has helped you please help me by liking and sharing the video and don't forget to subscribe to my youtube channel by subscribing you can stay connected with me and get regular updates from me in my next video, I will come with some special solved answer questions on compound interest. So don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel so that whenever I upload my next video, you will be notified by an email. I have uploaded videos on each of the 8 modes of this calculator. The mode 1 is computational mode which we used in this question. Mode 2 is complex number mode. Mode 3 statistics mode. Mode 4 number system mode. Mode 5 equation solver mode. Mode 6 matrix calculation mode mode 7 table generator mode and mode 8 vector algebra mode to know how to use every features of this calculator you can watch my previous videos on my youtube channel the link to my youtube channel is given at the end of the video so thanks for watching see you in my next video and stay connected by subscribing